Press F. Press F in the chat for me one, one time, please. But um, I'm sorry, Beef, that they had to show that SD, man. That was That's grimy. That's grimy. But can I get Josh Brody back on stage? I don't know who you guys love anymore. <laughs> okay, Wizzy, but he's not on stage. And then can I get 869 Horby on stage? Let's go, Beef. Commentators, take it. Those are uh, it's quite the shorts that Horby has on. I didn't see them earlier. Yeah. Um, so. Definitely look like, looks like he's ready to explore the water park a little bit. Yeah. yeah. I mean, if he wins this, he's going to... He's gonna be here even longer, so. Oh uh, yeah. I don't know, man. I don't know. Maybe it wasn't the smartest decision to be wearing swim, swim trunks when you're not oh, yeah. playing so, um, swimming. I just, I did get word uh, during that little break there that one million 12-minute sets is actually just under 23 years. So wow. if if uh, they play for 23 straight years, they'll be around a million sets. So I don't, I don't see it happening. <laughs> I don't see it happening. It's possible. I'm, calling, I'm gonna call Josh out on his math there. I don't think they played a million times. Probably not. Probably not. Yeah. How old is Josh? Thirty. Yeah, I'm gonna say no. Yeah. <laughs> Has the game been out that long? <laughs> no. <laughs> All right. Not quite. All right, so we're going right into it apparently. Okay. Uh, it looks like we are actually. Yeah. Okay. Or the, uh, Rock and Kirby, Josh, Rock and Pika. I don't see this changing at yeah. all. Um, both both have kind of established the, these characters as their uh, their go tos. Now, nice. Did they really plug into opposite ports? I'm gonna give them so hard of a time about this. <laughs> <laughs> Who does that? I don't know. You sit on the left side. You plug into the left port. Oh my goodness. But I mean, Josh does pretty well in this matchup. Nice uh, you saw him do the falling there. He, we talked about this earlier. He, did. he won't do that against me. Because <laughs> you know. He knows I will sacrifice myself to get that down air on him. <laughs> um, but he'll try it out against someone to see how they react to it. I mean, it's, it's a good option. Yeah, it is. All right. Josh Diaz off the platform. Yeah. Very I'm surprised good. that Horby didn't follow up with anything after that. It seemed like he, I think was he in a really expected him to stay on the platform. Yeah, that probably threw him off a little bit. He'll be ready for it next time, probably. Yeah. Okay, shielding oh, yeah, on the. You know that's coming. <laughs> shielding on the platform, and then he decides, all right, let me just slow drop through the plat. When, when and, Pika and is underneath the side plat, you can't just drop onto them. They're going to up tilt you. Yeah. I'm I'm surprised Horby kind of did that because it seems like as a a player. There, oh reverse back my air. gosh. Either one would have worked. Oh, Josh just completely oh. misses, but Horvy pulls back a little bit. Yeah. Um, afraid of the edge guard. And see, Horvy went to flat drop down there, there and he missed it. And lucky for him because he would have gotten up tilted. Oh, no. That's going to be it. Yeah. And really, when there's our four stock in yes. top eight, it happened. All you fantasy people. <laughs> um, I did not know there was fantasy at this event. Completely I didn't know either. On my, on that Somebody chance. actually messaged me in the chat and said, make sure to make your fantasy teams, and I thought they meant for Melee. <laughs> so I made a fantasy team for Melee. Also, anyone that picks me for fantasy, straight up, you're an idiot. <laughs> I always get way, way overvalued, yeah. and I'm terrible. <laughs> it's a horrible decision. Anyway. Corby, solid pick. Yeah. You see him all the way up here playing uh, to move on to fourth right now. Same with Josh. Yeah, next year if he's if he still comes, I think I'm I'm gonna put him on my team for sure. <laughs> Although I think I have to put myself on my own team. You know what I mean? Now, Horby lost a couple stocks there because he overextended on an edge guard like this. Like right he now. Put himself, he puts himself into these positions where he doesn't have enough jumps to get back. Yeah. Um, he keeps throwing out these downers, hoping to catch him. And then when he doesn't, he's just in this terrible situation where he has no jumps and has to resort yeah, to an up I don't upbeat. remember which Kirby player I was talking to. There he goes. Josh overextending this time. Yep. Um, but a lot of times as Kirby, you need to just grab the ledge. Just get back, <laughs> get to the ledge, and then worry about yeah. trying to attack. Like right there, he tried to approach with a forward air and try and get something extra that he didn't need when he could have just gone to ledge. Because uh, you know, a lot of Currys, they feel like they just have this unlimited number of jumps. But when you use three to get back and then you miss an attack, 
You only have these two bad jumps remaining. Slightly better than Jigglypuff's. Well, yeah, yeah, but so is everything. still terrible. <laughs> still terrible. Like Jigglypuff's last, last jump actually makes her go down. It's so bad. <laughs> yeah, it kind of just makes her like stop for a second. It's and a then negative jump. Instantly go downward. Uh, this game, closer than last, Harvey did take a stock. Yeah, he managed to take one but because again, Josh tries, overextended. Tries flat dropping on top of Josh, he just gets up tilted. Yeah, it's gonna happen every time. It's gonna happen every time. And even down airing Pika at the ledge isn't that safe because Pika can come in with an up air. Yep. Uh, I mean, sure, throw it out. Maybe you get a trade. You take the stock. Yeah. But that Pika up air is coming. Yeah. All right, gets a back air. Gets a grab. And Strong. somehow gets a reverse hit on that and doesn't get pushed uh -oh. off. That'll be a that'll be a stock. Yep. Overextended a little bit again. It, it looks like this is the story of this game. Yeah, I think jo <laughs> Josh just looks like he's feeling pretty comfortable in these edge guards, so he's just. He feels okay overextending, just like dropping those nares out there and seeing what'll happen. Yeah, he's um, probably not super worried about uh, worried about dropping the game to Horby. No, and I mean this is shaping up to be one of the faster Pika Kirby <laughs> sets I've gotten to watch recently. Yeah, it's usually a little bit more neutral. Uh, no, it's both these guys are just guarding. going crazy with these edge guards and, and missing and getting punished. <laughs> and, Quick stocks being taken. It's it's a lot more volatile than you would normally see. Like out of all like the top tier character matchups, this is the one that kind of just slows everything down. Besides, you know, like Kirby Dittos or Pika Dittos. Yeah, Kirby Puff. <laughs> well, Kirby Puff isn't really, I would say, a top tier matchup. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Fair. <laughs> see, oh Josh, he does get a turnaround this time, but he goes for a back air instead of like a weak nair. Or even an up air. I'd... Yeah, or an up air. All right. So that's the first stock, 69%. Again, Horry's DI is so strong that I think Josh is going to have a really hard time getting a, like a full combo on him. Yeah, it just seems like... Yeah. You said he was uh, rocking a uh, GameCube, GameCube controller, controller, correct? Yeah, unless unless something has changed recently. Uh, as far as I know, he always plays GameCube. Which yeah. is cool. Those of you that don't know, you can play this game with a with an adapter and a GameCube controller. And Adapters there are several are... very high-level players that do it, but like like Horby, like Fyro. Yeah. Um, Adapters are not that expensive either. No. If you're looking to get into oh, this game... Oh, there's a Nair, and there's the down air. But at being at 0%, oh, uh, Horby needs to recognize that it's not going to take a stock, and he needs to get back on stage. Yeah, your down air is not that good. No. It's not... It's not that good. I don't know. It's really good, but Josh it's not... There, and then a shield from Horby after getting that up tilt. Wow. Nice combo. All right. Misses the up air. But gets that one. And they uh, just drop yeah. off in the air. It's easy. And Josh, oh my so goodness. Josh, he always he always wants to go for those thunders yeah. as like just cheese. Yeah. He, he does he only goes for it when he thinks like he's guaranteed to be in the position to connect it. And right there, you know, he's up two games. Oh. He just wants that last stock thunder. Just so he can say he got one in this top eight. And Horby is just saying no. <laughs> I'm the gatekeeper. Yeah, and You're all Kirby has allowed. to do is keep putting that down air right there in the corner at the ledge, and Pikachu will never make it back. That's the only spot he can go, is to the ledge. Mm -hmm. And if he's all right, Josh it. is going to go for a Thunder here. No, no, he's giving up. No Thunder. He missed <laughs> He missed the one. He's like, it's last stock. <laughs> if I miss it, I might drop the game. Yeah. He's got to keep the 3-0 streak going. The 3-0 streak is alive, and we only have four more matches left. I mean, we just we have winner's finals coming up with uh, with Boom and Wizrow, yep. which could be a 3-0. It could. Boom's done it. I, I could Wizzy, definitely see Wizzy it. Wizzy has 3-0'd Boom. Really? I remember that tournament. Genesis 4 is a long time ago. Boom